Hi and welcome to Power by Code. My name is Tommy and today I'll show you how to mine cubic using the Treefold Grid. Go to the website playground.grid.tf. In this example, I'm already logged in and have connected my Treefold wallet to the web page. If this is very new to you, have a look at my other videos about Treefold. Under Full Virtual Machine, give your virtual machine a name. I enter Cubic Miner 01. Select custom capacity, enter the numbers of CPUs you want to use. In this example, I want to use 16. In memory, I enter 4069. It seems to be enough memory support when mining cubic with 16 threads. In network, activate add wireguard access. Scroll a bit down. Select the country where you want to deploy your cubic miner. I select Belgium. Select a farm you want to use. In this example, I select Nyein underscore zero zero zero. Select a node from the list. I select node 3172. The playground is doing a last resource check. Click on deploy. Your virtual machine is now being deployed on the node. It will take around one minute. When deployed, copy the WireGuard config. Open WireGuard, click on Add Tunnel, and click on Add Empty Tunnel. Give your tunnel a name. I enter Cubic Miner 3172. Paste in the WireGuard settings from your deployed virtual machine. Click on Save. Click on Activate. Open the PowerShell and the website playground.grid.tf. Copy the WireGuard IP in the PowerShell, write SSH root add and paste in the WireGuard IP and hit enter. Write yes and hit enter. You are now connected to a virtual machine on a Treefold grid. Time to install Cubic Miner. Open the website github.com slash cubic li slash client. Click on Linux service installation. Open Notepad. Copy the Ubuntu 22.04 install script. Paste in the script and change thread count to 16. And replace the access token with your payout ID from your cubic wallet. If you do not have a cubic wallet yet, Check out my video about how to create a cubic wallet using Windows 11. Add a worker name after the payout ID. I enter Treefold Miner 01. Copy all the text and paste the text inside the PowerShell. And hit enter. Time to start a cubic miner. Scroll a bit down. Copy and run the command system ctl start qli in the PowerShell. The cubic miner is now running in the background. To see what is happening, copy and run the command tail 
slash f slash var slash log slash uli dot log in the PowerShell. After some time, it seems that I hit around 380 iterations per second with a 16 threads virtual machine using the threefold grid. If you want to see how many solutions you have found, you can go to the website app.cubic.li slash public slash pool slash your payout ID. After some days of mining, I have found 13 solutions in total. And as you can see, my threefold miner 01 seems to have found the most solutions at the moment, even with a lower iteration per second. That's it. You can now mine Cubic using the threefold grid. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe button.